This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Mary Nelson with 3 News Now, and here's a look at what's happening. We start with an update on the Omaha woman missing since Sunday night. The boat 20-year-old Emma Olson was in capsized in the Missouri River. This morning, her body was recovered near Blair, south of where the boat sank. Harrison County Emergency Management saying in a statement, the investigation into what happened is ongoing. And we continue to follow the impacts of Monday's massive fire at Knox Creek. We've learned the Environmental Protection Service has been called in. What we still don't know are the potential immediate and long-term ramifications on public health. That's because it's still unclear which chemicals were involved in the fire. 3 News Now reached out to Knox Creek again today. A rep says they aren't interested in talking and referred us to the State Department of Environment and Energy. And I'm 3 News Now meteorologist Chris Swain. Mid 50s tonight, not as cool as where we were heading into early Thursday. Added cloud cover keeping us mild in the mid 50s. Transitioning into Friday afternoon, 82 degrees, partly cloudy skies. Rain chances are going to hold off until late in the day and at that very spotty. That is to say, plenty of dry time. Most don't see any rain on Friday. Saturday and Sunday comes with its own set of activity. Could have some leftover storms early Saturday morning. The lion's share of this activity is late Saturday into Sunday. And while not completely a washout, you have to keep the rain gear handy uh, just in case. Upper 70s by Sunday with rain chances looking a little bit lower than earlier in the week. Something we'll have to watch. Mid 70s next week running cooler for June. Cloud cover works its way back in just enough to have to mention some isolated to scattered storms each day as temperatures get back to 77 on Thursday.